It was my first night in the City of Angels. I'd come from the Midwest to the big city to prove to my pop that I could be successful. I was young, ambitious, looking for love, and, and nothing was going to stop me. Nothing. No- Drop the bag! <laughs> what are you going to do, fork me to death? Or so I thought. After that catastrophe, I decided to get a drink. To my surprise, the place was filled with beautiful dames. Cheers to being pretty girls. Unlike my old town, which was usually filled with sad, miserable, angry husbands in their mid-40s. So happy drinks. To my surprise, there was this one dame who was all alone. So many questions. Who was she? How was she so beautiful? How would I get to meet her? What beer was she drinking? Hey there, handsome. Can I take Nothing water? mattered. It was like time stopped. She was the most Excuse beautiful me, woman I had ever- Hey! Mm. Hi! Well, it's about time. What can I get for you? Uh, beer, please. Mm -hmm. And could you please tell me who that lovely dame is across the way? Oh, Cookie? Don't even think about it. She'll eat you alive. Sounds fun. <laughs> Well, if you need anything, just shout. Ten bucks says she'll reject it. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> I figured I had a good chance. It seemed worth the risk. Hey, look, he walks. <laughs> hey, baby. You wanna give me a shot? I suppose you think you deserve a drink for that. I suppose I owe you a replacement bottle. Okay, deal. <sighs> so you're new in town. How do you know? Well, first, the hat you're wearing, and second, you have a pin that says tourist on your vest. What the? Do, do. Never mind. So, uh, why are you sitting here all by yourself? I don't get serious with anyone my father doesn't approve of. Doubt he'd approve of any of these bums. Well, uh, what would, uh, Daddy Cookie think of me? What, did I say something funny? It's nothing. A lot of people know who my father is, and my father doesn't like most people. What about me? I'm a pretty likable guy. I can tell. He was falling head over heels for you. Well, I am rather charming. <coughs> You're quite the little prince. Enough for your pop? Not even close. Well, then give me another chance to woo you. It could be dangerous. I love danger. 
That's my address. But come at your own risk. If my father finds you, you'll be sorry. I'm so. Try a slight chance of certain death. <laughs> <laughs> I had been given a mission, so I decided to woo her the only way I knew how. song that I know. What are you doing? I'm serenading you. Don't be an idiot. I'm an idiot for love. Hey, stupid! <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you were talking. Miss Cookie, I'll save you. Just, just give me a second. Oh, leave him alone. He's harmless enough. I've had enough of this. Listen, Cookie, I have to admit, ever since I saw you in that restaurant, I felt alive. You make me feel warm ah. inside. Like nobody else, you make me feel, you make me feel electric. Oh. I thought it went well until I woke up tied to a pool table. I felt like I was in a French pain pleasure brothel. Not that I've ever actually been to one of those. <laughs> you know who I am. I'm feared in this state. I am half of L.A. I make men's bowels cringe. With fear. I, I'm, I'm sorry, you're scaring the shit out of me. With fear! And a fairy like you breaks into my house? Well, boss, technically, I brought him into the house. Shut up! Even after you are warned. You tried to molest my one and only daughter. Well, actually, he was singing to her. I think it was singing, but it, it was really awful, it was bad. Quiet! 
What makes you think you have any right to date my daughter? Well, she, she's just so special and, and I'm handsome and smart and tall and mysterious and clever and intelligent and yeah. What about that bump on your head? I don't have a bump on my head. You really just keep walking into these, don't you? What? Ah! It, ah. <laughs> Ow! So let me get this straight. You think that after coming to LA, getting rough, you have the right to see my daughter? You thought about having children? Well, no, not really. I, I mean, at, at least not yet. <laughs> personal business card of Mr. Wheat from Iowa. Because he's my dad? Really? Yeah, you know him. How do you think I make my booze? <laughs> well, this changes everything. All right. I mean, you're going to let him go? I mean, without doing anything to him? Does this mean I can date Cookie? Well, yes, my boy. Yes. <laughs> what What you doing? Whistling. You know how to whistle, don't you? I could give it a shot. <laughs> <laughs> We'll work on it. So, you love me yet? More tomorrow. That was good. That was good. That was good. All right.